Hi, I'm Christine from the LTC. Today I'm going to show you how to switch between the grid view and the reading view when in discussions. You now have two ways to view your discussions. You can view them in either grid view or reading view. In reading view, clicking on a topic name will bring you to a list of threads within that particular topic. Go to your D2L course and click on discussions. Go to a topic and within there you can click on a thread. Clicking on a thread will take you to the initial discussion response and all replies. In grid view, you will see all threads and replies in the same list. Clicking on a thread will bring it below in another window. You can read the message and choose to reply. You can also click next to read the next message or click above. To change the discussion view settings, you can click on settings in the right hand corner. This will bring up your personal settings options, and under default view, you can choose between grid and reading views. This changes the view that all discussions will appear in, but you also have the option to individually change each discussion area to your particular choice. Go back to discussions. Choose the drop down box next to the discussion you want to change the viewing options to, and click either view topic in grid view or view topic in reading view, depending on your default settings. You will also be able to subscribe from here as well. If you would like to print your thread, you can do so in one of two ways. First, if you are in Reading View, you can click on the drop-down box next to the thread name and choose Print Thread. Second, if you are in Grid View, click on the discussion you want to print, and then you can just click on the Print button located next to the Delete and mark on red buttons at the top of the thread. Finally, if you would like to receive notifications of new messages in a specific discussion topic or forum, simply click subscribe under the thread name. You can also click the subscribe option after you have posted in a topic. Thank you for watching, and if you have any questions on D2L, please post your question in the D2L support form.